There are times that God will bring crushing, persecution, resistance, and only the spirit filled produce power under pressure. Only the spirit filled produce power under pressure. If you don't have the Holy Spirit within you, pressure does not produce power. It produces fear. It produces compromise. It produces emotional breakdowns. It produces weird doctrines. It produces isolation and moodiness and impatience and anger. When the pressure is on, whatever is inside of you will come out. We are in a time of great pressing today. We are in a time of great pressure. And God is revealing who has the goods. Before God can use you, he has to shake you from the familiar and then put you under pressure. How many of you in this season, you've been feeling a little bit of shaking? You've been feeling a little bit of pressure. You know what amazes me is even though you've been under this pressure, you're still here. You've been under this shaking and you're still here. That's because God is going to do something with you. You watching online, you're, you're, you're still in it. You, you may feel like this is something you can't handle. You may feel like the pressures are against you. You may feel like everything is falling apart. But I can assure you this, when you feel like it's falling apart, it's because God is shaking you from the comfortable. He loves you too much to leave you in your comfort. He loves you too much to leave you in the ordinary. You may say, I wasn't in sin. I was living clean and everything's being shaken. Do you realize that the mediocre, even though it is not sinful, it is an insult to the glory of God? I'm going to say that again because somebody needs to hear that. The mediocre, even though it is not sinful, is an insult to the glory of God. Yes, many believers compromise in sin. Even more compromise in comfort. Even more compromise in conformity. Even more compromise in complacency. If you want to walk in the anointing, you must learn to walk away from temptation. The power of God on your life is directly proportionate to the purity within your life. It's time to get things under the blood. It's time to put compromise aside and let the Holy Spirit do his work in us. Let the Holy Spirit have his way. I want the anointing on my life to increase. I pray for it all the time. I want the kind of anointing that causes transformation in even the most difficult cases. But God needs you to first lay down your life. God needs you to first surrender. So many say, Holy Spirit, fill me. And he says, I can't because you're full of yourself. We say, God, use me. He says, I can't because you're letting others use you. You're saying, God, speak to me. He says, I can't because you're filling your ears with garbage. God, I want to preach the gospel. You're too busy preaching politics. God, I'm ready to surrender. Oh, you can't even surrender your morning prayer. This is what God is calling us to. No more compromise. It's time to start preaching the gospel. 
It's time to start declaring the one truth. It's time to stop being distracted by the debates and the bickering and the arguing. It's time to rise above it all and declare, I am not ashamed of the gospel. It is the power of God unto salvation. But God's looking for surrender. Surrender, surrender. You guys, we don't hear that anymore. We don't hear about surrender anymore. We hear 12 steps to a better this and 10 steps to a better that and five steps to improve on this. And we spend all this time trying to build what God told us to crucify. All the preaching ever is how to climb your mountain, how to climb your mountain. You know why they have to teach you how to climb your mountain? Because they don't have the power or the faith to move mountains. And power and faith to move mountains only comes when you're surrendered to the Holy Ghost. Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Also, help us spread the gospel of Jesus Christ in the power of the Holy Spirit. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.